a big miss for the city. We are just learning that Oakland lost out on a chance to get millions of dollars in state money to try and crack down on organized retail crime. So they were eligible to get part of a $267 million the state had set aside to help cities fight these kind of crimes. But Oakland did not submit their application for the money in time, citing technical issues. So they're missing out. News that local leaders cannot believe. They say it only weakens people's faith in the city to accomplish what they need to do. It's not just for myself losing confidence from our leaders, okay? I think the people in general now, they feel that number one, they don't feel safe and the things that can be done, but they are not doing it. So I think uh, in general, I think many people uh, are losing confidence in, in the leadership of our city. Local business owners say they will while appreciate this proactive step the city is taking with Activate Oakland, like we showed you, and also other programs, the fact that they missed out on extra resources is just another hurdle for them to have to deal with. It's the double-edged sword. Unfortunate that that's happened, but I'm always optimistic that, you know, things will work out. But it's just going to take more resources and um, more creative minds to come together and try to find a solution. Meantime, San Francisco is poised to get more than $17 million from the state for this program. About $15 million would go to the police department to increase patrols, despite them already getting a budget boost this year from the mayor. The DA's office would get the other $2 million to help them prosecute any alleged thieves that are caught.